What's going on, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, back again with another reaction video. Today, we're going to get into something new, something random, something different. In fact, it's so different, I don't even know what to say it is. It's in Arabic. I, I literally cannot read the title. Don't know what it is. Uh, it's from Telecom Egypt. The description is in Arabic. Um, everything's in Arabic. The comments are in Arabic. I don't, I don't know how I got here. I don't know what I'm doing here, but it's different and we're going to give it a go. So it was recommended to me uh, by someone in the DMs. They slid in and said, hey, you should check this out. You should check out some Arab music. You know, they sent this one and another one. And this one was more like rap and like Afrobeat. And the other one was soft. And I was like, I'm feeling kind of like I want to get into some rap from another country on the other side of the world. So we're going to jump right into it. Hope you're having a good day. Come vibe with your boy. I have no idea what to expect. Oh, some crispy horns. I don't even know how I'm going to title this. I don't know the artist. I don't know... I don't know what I don't know Okay. <laughs> Dude's definitely been eating his spinach. In the hell, my bin, I'm a bench, but she does sick of a shit bill hand. Higher hand, control, you need lang, rubber band. My official task, Milan Abida, my fashion, but talk, you hate the tenebus, Mishahir Mahata, Sammy, I love that if I can so nearly guy be rata, the Dialago, Mishil Hek, do the hot show, I shall last, Mishid do, a talacolo, Guzzi go, Zohor Navia, Ulawi, Wugot Kofia Sanawi, one of his surely al bank. Oh, <laughs> Aqua mix, it a big rig. That was nice. That was nice. Hata, drip, Mickey Wigs. Ah, the way he's riding that pocket. But I hold Nashil Wish. Mickey Wigs. I forgot what the first part of the song sounds like because we, we ended up on this. We are a mix, my head is standing out of your mind. We mix. Aqua mix, things on my head. We, I blah, I had. Okay, all right. Uh, that was a crazy first experience dipping my toes into Arabic rap and Egyptian culture music. That I don't even know what to say. First thing, the the rap you can tell a couple things. One, they're pretty big artists. The production and the quality of everything from the way the the music sounds and the visuals are higher budgeted, right? They have money, they they're established artists, they sound good. They're professional. Secondly, the rapper you can tell that one's a rapper and one's more of like a vibe, melodic kind of guy. And I think that's a good collaboration because the first guy is rapping. The bald guy, he is rapping his ass off. Okay, I don't know what he was saying. I tried to get closed captions. There's no closed captions for this, so I'm just in the dark. Um, I'm going to guess it's a little bit of a flexing kind of song and they're just rapping about life and maybe a little bit of money, women, cars kind of thing. The visuals go into that. They're just having a good time. But the first guy was rapping and you can tell... It's funny, you don't even have to speak a language to know when someone's rapping good and when they're rapping uh, 
at a higher level because of sounds like the 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 rhyming tones of like vowels, you know, a e i o u, and then in Arabic the same sounds that you hear over and over, but then also the syllables, like the vocals on in rap or any song, the vocals are another instrument that's added to the instrumentation. And here, the rapper was going off. Okay, he had flow switches. He had, I would assume, are some bars in there. I don't know how clever the bars are, but he definitely had some bars because you could tell the way that he wrote them. There were setups with punchlines, and the way that he delivered them, I could tell when a punchline happened. I just don't know what he was saying. So I like the rapper in here. He seems very skilled, especially with his flow. Um, and then the other guy, the vibes, the guy that brought the vibes, he has a little bit of rap to him, but he's mainly there for the vibes and kind of the way that he rode the beat and had a little bit more melody. He definitely brought a different energy to it. And that's when the beat switched, right? So, I mean, I enjoyed this. I don't know what they were saying, but I like the vibe of it. And that's, that's the cool thing about music is like, you don't necessarily have to understand the lyrics because if the vibe is good, um, that's what ultimately matters because the vibe of any song is going to make you feel something. The lyrics are going to dictate how strong that feeling is, right? You um, you could listen to any any music on any side of the planet and not understand the, the lyrics, but you can understand the feeling of that song, right? This is more of like a kind of club happy song. And the lyrics are going to make it if you understand the lyrics, it's going to make it that much better. So as far as this is my first time listening to Arabic music, Egyptian music, you know, that other side of the world and not understanding it, I actually vibed. I, I enjoyed this. It had a good pace to it. It had a good energy. Um, it's it's definitely kind of a party song. Like I wanted to move. I wanted to get up. It was filling me with energy. Um, and they sound good. The production's good. The mix is good. The visuals are good. I mean, I wouldn't mind checking more of them out. Hopefully... On the next one, maybe there's a lyrics uh, translation or something, or maybe I could go back and listen to the lyrics on this one and check the translation. I don't know, but uh, pretty cool, man. I'm not going to lie. That was pretty cool for not being able to understand anything. I was vibing. So, And also, I don't know the names of these artists. If you guys could leave that in the comment section, I'm, you know, I'm going to I'm gonna look it up right now, but if you guys could also leave that in the comment section, that would help and let me know things about them. Um but yeah, I don't even know what the name of the song is. I don't know what these artists are. I'm going to have to look that up for the, the reaction, the title. But that was pretty cool, man. So that will do it for today's reaction video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, leave a comment down below. It helps your channel grow. It helps YouTube algorithm. If you're new here and you haven't done so, be sure to hit that subscribe button. I drop a video every day. If you're not new here, welcome back. Appreciate the love and support. You don't know what to do. Leave some comments down below. What do you think? Do you like it? Do you not like it? Do you understand it? Do you speak Arabic? If so, let me know in the comment section. That's awesome. If you didn't like it, let me know too. That comment section is for y'all. If you're a fan of either of these artists, whatever their names are, I'll put it in the title, but go support them. Always support the artist, the band, the YouTuber, the entertainer, whoever's making content and music for you, support that person. So with all that being said, hope you're having a great day. Send a positive vibes your way. And until next time, I'm out. Trust in me, cause you're running from your problems